with the Florida Crafter and I'm here to share with you a couple of projects that I've been working on. Uh, as I said in one of my last videos, uh, I've been working on some candles for an upcoming craft fair and I just want to share a couple of them with you. Uh, I think two of them you've already seen but I went back and I um, redid a couple of things on them to spruce them up a little bit. And let me go ahead and show them to you. This first one here is a candle that has a Thanksgiving scripture on it. And it says, I will praise God's name and song and glorify him with Thanksgiving, Psalm 69 and 30. And these candles are made by melting the tissue on the candle by placing a piece of wax paper on top. Back here is where I had to seam it or had to piece it together because the can the tissue or napkin wasn't long enough to go all the way around so I had to piece it together back there and and that's that just covered the entire candle and this is some of that fabulous rosette ribbon with the beads in the middle picked up from Hobby Lobby and this is what the napkin looked like I picked these up from Hobby Lobby it was 50 in a pack and I think they were like five ninety nine and 40 percent off and what's great about this particular napkin is, is you get the sentiment or scripture four different times. So even though it sounds like it might be a little pricey, what you're actually getting your money's worth because you're getting that four times on each napkin. And as I said, it's 50 in a pack. This was the first one that I did that I shared with you a couple of days ago. And again, what this is, this is actually a stamp that I stamped on a piece of tissue paper, laid it on the candle, and adhered, held rather, a piece of wax paper on and heated it with the heat tool and let it all melt into the candle. And then I went back and added some Recollections bling picked up from Michaels and that fabulous piece of bling in the middle. And as I said, this first one that I made, I think I'm going to give it to my daughter because her bathroom is pink and black. And that goes all the way around. And then the next one I have here was also from a napkin picked up from Hobby Lobby at the checkout stand. And what it says is behind every successful woman is a fabulous pair of shoes. And here is the napkin that that came from. And again, I just pulled the, separated all the layers and adhered the napkin to the front of the candle wrapped a piece of wax paper around it and let it all melt into the candle and then this piece the zebra print around the top as you can see it's the part that's on the bottom of the camera of the napkin rather and please excuse that ratty nail and then what I did also is I separated that and then I just included that around the entire candle as well added a hot piece of hot pink piece of bling there and a, a prima flower that I picked up from Tuesday morning a while ago and then added a little bling, bling um, embellishment in the middle of that and and that's it for now uh, someone did request that I do a tutorial on this I might build up the nerve to do that but if not what I will do is I will share some links below it won't be in this video as soon uh, right now but I'll come back and I'll add some links below as to where I picked up this um, idea from as always thanks for stopping by and have a blessed day bye